Prime Minister Datu Sri Isma Sabri Yaakob paid his last respects to former Defence Minister Tan Sri Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin, Tengku Ismail, during the burial ceremony at the Bukit Kiara Muslim Cemetery on Saturday. Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin, who was also a former AMNO Disciplinary Board Chairman and a member of the Supreme Council, passed away at his residence in Jalan Tuta at 8.43pm on Friday, aged 94. Yes, I, uh juga merasa sedih dengan pemergian Allah Yarham yang merupakan seorang pemimpin yang disegani bukan saja di dalam kerajaan tetapi juga di dalam politik sebagai ahli UMNO jawatan tertinggi yang dipegang oleh almarhum adalah naik presiden UMNO dan banyak kementerian yang diterajui oleh Allah ya Rahman. Sewaktu beliau di dalam kajian dan jawatan terakhir dalam amnu pun adalah sebagai pengusi lembaga disiplin. Adanya sembangan oleh Allah ya Rahman kepada amnu berterusan ya, sehinggalah hari hari terakhir pun ya beliau masih lagi dengan amnu dan uh, saya percaya waktu menjawab jawatan naik presiden AMNO banyak perkara-perkara yang telah pun dilakukan untuk memperkukuhkan AMNO. Jadi AMNO kehilangan seorang pemimpin dan negara juga. Also present was Tan Sri Tengku Razali Hamza. Oh well, he's my cousin. We are quite close. But he's from the petani side, you know, of our family. Very active in sports in sports. And also, he was very passionate legal uh, professional. He's a very good man. He's got many friends, a lot of admirers. He has uh, prominently appeared for us in international forums and spoke on our behalf on matters concerning this region, ASEAN region especially. But he'll be remembered. Earlier funeral prayers for Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin were performed at the Federal Territory Mosque. Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin served as Defence Minister from 1987 to 1990. He was minister with special functions to assist Tun Abdul Raza in the Foreign Ministry in 1973. Other posts included being the Information and Special Functions Minister in 1974, Foreign Minister in 1975, Trade and Industry Minister in 1981 before being reappointed as the Foreign Minister in 1984 and Information Minister in 1986. Earlier, Yang Dipertuan Agong, Al Sultan Abdullah Riyaduddin Al Mustafa Bilah Shah and Raja Pemaisuri Agong, Tunku Haja Aziza Amina Maimuna Iskandaria also expressed their condolences to Tunku Ahmad Ridaudin's family. Their Majesties expressed sadness over Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin's passing and praised highly his service, deeds and sacrifices for the country. Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin left behind wife Tengku Puan Sri Noraini, Tengku Zainal Abidin and six children.